I gotta walk for 24 hours or until I hit 50,000 steps. And if I wanna get to sleep tonight, I gotta try and hit that goal before bedtime. But for what purpose, sire? So I can push myself to my breaking point and make stacks. That's right. There are apps that exist that pay you to walk. So I downloaded like 10 of them to see if I can make a good amount of money today and if this can be a legit money-making method. And with that out of the way, here's the game plan. Hey, it's your boy, Wrinkly T. That's my gang sign. <laughs> It's about 10 right now, and I'm looking pale. Your boy put sunscreen on. Okay, here's the game plan. No running. I'm going to walk as slow as I can today. Not because I'm lazy, not because I'm fat, or not, not because I can't do it. But because if you, if you go faster, you take way less steps than you do when you go slower. If every step is a, a money, why would I even run? Anyways, I'm going to go walk for like two hours. I'll see you at lunch. And the place I decided to start walking is around this juicy, mouth-watering pool. Look a lot. I found out that each lap around this pool is 60 steps. So if I walk 100 laps around it, I'll be at 6,000 steps in actually no time. I was just trying to drill the fact into my brain that I have to keep moving for the next 24 hours until I hit 50,000 steps. Or I die. Not really, but I'll just be really disappointed. Anyways, I forgot to mention it was supposed to be 90 degrees today. So I quickly inherited a hat and started to play some jazz music. The heat was driving me insane as you could probably already tell. So I had to finish my 100 laps quickly and move to the shade. But before I did that, I tried to have a staring contest with the sun. 6,000 steps in, I moved down to this acquaintly benign shaded patio. I have no idea what those words mean. To finish up my first 10,000 steps of the day, and to work up my little stomach before we eat a lunch. Let me tell you something! It was so much better under the shade. Not only was the sun not licking my pores, but there wasn't a pool that was secretly manipulating me to jump in and go for a swim. So after a bit, I finally hit 10,000 steps, which has got to be a world record, right? 10,000 steps in an hour and a half? Who am I? Hungry! I'm hungry! Uh, 10,000 steps at the moment. It's almost noon. I'm not feeling as ze- not zesty. I should- I'm not feeling as like- as a, I don't know. I usually feel like that while walking, I guess. You hear my stomach? Can you hear him? He's saying, feed me Canadian bacon and bread and cucumber. Ah! I need to eat. I need to eat a lot of food. And this is the most awkward time because ah, I'm walking in a circle ah, and there's bugs chasing me. Ah. The bottom line is your boy's hungry. I gotta go inside to eat. And then I'm probably gonna stay inside because the sun is actually shooting me a lot. I'll, I'll see you inside. I then started to awkwardly make lunch while walking in place. Then I devoured it like a family of five. And then I really awkwardly did the dishes like a penguin. But after I fueled up, I felt good and got some more steps inside because it was cooler and so that I would not die from extreme heat exhaustion. I was excited to see how much we were going to make by the end of the day because I actually really enjoy walking. And if I can make some money out of this, it will be a huge revelation. So after walking inside for a while, my bones started to riot against my brain. It felt like I was reverting back to the primordial soup. So my absolutely huge brain got to thinking. And so at around 15,000 steps, I decided to do an experiment. All right. You can't see me because I'm up here. Hello. I look like I've been out in the forest for a couple of years. I am going to experiment with a strategy at the moment. My stomach is actually burning a hole in my organs because I haven't digested because I've been walking this entire time. So I'm going to try and sit down and like do steps while sitting down. See if it works like this. This is going to be... Ooh. Yeah, I'm still going. Still going when I'm sitting down. If this works, this will be the greatest strat I've ever figured out. <gasps> it worked! It worked! It worked! It worked! It worked! It worked! That just gave me energy. I can actually go to the bathroom now. The experiment was not a letdown, and it would help me rest a bit, but also get me more steps. So I watched a Sidemen video while doing it, which led me to another genius strategy. He didn't expect it. Ah! You didn't expect me to step like this, did you? I'm somewhat smart, I know. And I figured that I could recover my legs and get steps while my legs are in the pool. It's 90 degrees out right now and I'm melting. At least my feet 
are not falling apart like pulled pork ribs. I kicked my feet in the water for a while until I got closer to 20,000 steps. And this guy was still stalking me. Look at him. I caught him in full HD. Then my idea evolved a little bit and it got me to 20,000 steps around three, which was when I had a really stupid idea that could have ended badly. 20,000 on the pool, kind of, yeah. It's about three. If you, if you can see up there, it's 257. That means I have nine hours until midnight. And if I want to get some sleep tonight, I have to hit 50,000 steps before then. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed run 10,000 steps and I'm going to do it in that field over there. I'm going to act like a lawnmower like this. I'm going to try and do it in under an hour. So by the time it hits four o'clock, I'm going to be at 30,000 steps for the rest of the day. I, I think I can just, you know, explore, relax. Maybe, I don't know. I had an hour to get 10,000 steps to get me to 30,000 when it turned four o'clock. And the reason why I said this was a stupid idea was because I decided to do this at the day's peak heat, which meant that I was walking under the bare 90 degree sun with bugs that would not leave me alone and that drove me insane. But not as insane as the sun was. Halfway through my speed run, I was dying and losing my mind. But the outside was beautiful. Look at that cloud right there. Yeah, what, what a cloud, isn't it? <laughs> and at some point, the bugs must have realized that I was him and stopped trying to nest in my ears, which led me to be proud to present you the ASMR section of the video. That's what it sounds like the entire time. That's why here, the entire time. I have no music. I have no thoughts. It's just grass and feet. I'm not thinking about feet. As I was finishing up my speed run, I was mathing in my head because if I walked at four miles an hour, that means I would have been spot on 10,000 steps within the hour, but I was actually pretty incorrect. Oh my God. Oh God. Oh. I'm actually going to faint. I think I'm going to faint. Timer went off. That's an hour. Let's go check what I'm at. It's four o'clock right now. I, I pray. I pray that it's at least 30,000. That was one of the hardest things I've ever done. All hail me. Yeah. This is the grand. Oh my God, I'm gonna actually die. I need to get out of the sun. I'm going to see how many steps I have after that speed run. <laughs> An hour of steps outside in the heat. 26 now. I need 24,000 more steps. I don't know what I'm going to do. I actually have no clue. I had now entered my depression arc where I walked to 30,000 steps and pondered for a while before I had yet another amazing idea. 30,000 and white. Do you know what that means? I'm going back outside. But this time, I'm, let, me, let, me just show, let me just show you how I'm gonna get some of the rest of my steps. It's you guys. <laughs> oh. oh! Oh my god! Oh. oh, I can't even describe the lactose. Your boy goes to Yale Online College, and I cooked up an idea where I put my phone in three plastic bags so it wouldn't get water in it, and then jumped in the pool so I can have fun in the pool, and my phone is still on me, and I'm still getting steps because that's just the way I am. And now we don't have to suffer anymore and we can just enjoy this bo bo boisterous afternoon. And that is exactly what I did. So you should enjoy this boisterous afternoon with me for just a moment. I am out of the pool, and so are you guys. I don't know why you're my phone. Look at these pruny prunes. See how pruned they are? It's six right now. I put an hour in there. I hope I at least got 5,000, but I'm hoping for way more. 34,000 steps. Even though I didn't get even close to 10,000, I got, I, I was still so relaxing. I feel like I can do 15,000 more. Oh, I'm going to, I have to. If I want to get to sleep tonight, I have to. I'm gonna go finish up my 5,000 steps elsewhere. I don't know where, probably not out here. And then I'm gonna go eat dinner.
You heard me right. I didn't say anything yet. I'm gonna shower. You heard me right. I'm gonna shower because I smell like absolute pool. Somebody's clean and showered and fresh and minty. Probably not minty. This day has tortured me enough. Now it's time for me to torture the day. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Maybe just by doing like 5,000 more steps out here. I'm gonna complete 40,000 steps down here, which is my personal best ever. I'll see you at dinner time. Well, we're gonna have a, a feast. Today could have been one of the worst days for me, but I don't think the world wanted it to be. 50,000 steps might not seem a lot to you. It's not even a marathon in length, but it's a lot to me, and I couldn't stop for anything. I suffered too much to give up, as much as I wanted to, and I knew that I had to pull through for you guys, myself, and the place where I was walking because in this moment, I was really appreciating where I was. And a lot of the times we get caught up doing whatever we do in life, and forget to appreciate the outdoors. You don't know how much it can help you feel alive. But none of that matters because I am so hungry. I reached my personal best of 40,000 steps and made this masterpiece of a meal. Don't worry, I'm still moving my legs and they must call me Hiroshima the way I bombed that bowl. But now I was on the last stretch. I was so close to reaching my goal and saying how much money I made. And I figured what better place to walk than the place we started at. I just want you to know that you have to be a little delusional sometimes to get what you want. At the beginning of today, I thought I would never get to 50,000 steps and that I would die along the way. But I dreamt big, tried my absolute hardest, and it paid off. But not everything will always go the way you want it to go. Especially when you walk 50,000 steps and only get paid $2.12. Have a day.